I'm meeting you here at the Wii U menu to show uh, what I am going to be doing today. You see here? Shovel Knight. I got it on the eShop um, recently. I also got... I have to keep switching because I'm not allowed to do it otherwise. Uh, Child of Light as well on the eShop. Felt like spending some money. Yeah. It won't let me choose if I... Uh... Here we go. Let's go back here. So yeah, I'm going to play some Shovel Knight right now because why not? So I'm going to have to select it like this. Preparing update. Oh, it has to update. Well, hopefully this doesn't take too long. Yeah, uh, while I'm waiting for a good day to do um, the final boss to Persona 3, I'm going to be playing this for now. I figured why not. Seems like a good game for what I've heard so far. Kind of a retro style uh, 2D platforming game. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know if I should have met you here at, at the game itself. Oh well. Here we go. Shovel Knight. Use up, down to scale the screen until the arrows fit into the corners. Yep, seems good to me. Yacht Club Gains. Very 8-bit. Yeah, I went up and down a little bit, you saw, just so I can help sync myself here because I didn't really have a chance to. Alright, features. B is the select button, that's kind of weird. Uh, feats. Oh, feats, not features. Our options. Uh, controls. Relic input type. Up plus attack. Jump and attack is A and Y. Inventory is minus. Interesting NES style music here. I'm playing with the gamepad though, and I like how they give it like a NES style controller, even though that's wrong. Whatever. Whatever. Audio. Nope, I meant to go to audio. That ah, seems fine to me. Video. Gamepad screen is sub. Brightness screen scan. Ah, it's fine. Alright, let's start game. Let's see how good this really is. Now you get a lot of profiles here. Register your name. Well, you know what I'm going with. I shall go with the regular Chuck. Because, yes. Alright then, let's see how this game is. Everything good here, we got 4 health, nothing, no time, 0, 0, everything. Yes. Are we ready for some Shovel Knight? Aho! Uh -huh. Long ago, the lands were untamed and roamed by legendary adventures. Adventures. Got a little bit of the FM, the... Wait. All... Of the all heroes, none shown brighter than Shovel Knight and Shield Knight. But their travels together ended at the Tower of Fate when a cursed amulet brought a terrible magic. When Shovel Knight awoke, the tower was sealed and Shield Knight was gone. His spirit broken, a grieving Shovel Knight went into. A life of solitude. But without companion uh, champions, the land was seized by a vile power, the enchantress and her order of no quarter. Now the tower is unsealed and devastation looms. A new adventure is about to begin. Get digging. Anyways, what I was about to say is um, the VR looks like it sounds like they're using the VRC chips, uh, possibly from Famitrack or something. If anyone is familiar with the VRC chip, it was a chip used to enhance certain Famicom games. I'm trying to get used to the jumping like that. Certain Famicom games to give it better music, using the Japanese version of Castlevania 3. 
and a few other games. Anyway, you can look that up later on. Interesting art style because of the parallax scrolling, so it's like an enhanced NES game in a way. At least some effort looks like it went into it. So far it's interesting, but not much so far has happened, so can't say much about it. Now, you gotta be able to dig down, right? I'm pretty sure... Oh, I just... We don't really dig down. We just press down and our shovel goes down. I get it. Hmm. Can I bounce on the bubbles? Probably. So if I do this... Well, I'm aiming it in incorrectly. It's the most obvious, um... Inspiration is Mega Man. There's no doubt about it. What's this? What are you? What are you? I can destroy it, it looks like. It's just hard to jump to it a bit. Can I do anything about it? If I do it like this... Ugh. Ugh. It doesn't look like giving me the Unless it's a save point, maybe, for all I know. Like... Midway point type thing. I mean, it's interesting so far. Oh, I got hurt. Oh, they're pretty gents with the life when you think about it. You don't lose the entire circle in one go. Yep, yeah, they're re they're really going for the nest feel here. Not that I have a problem with it per se, but let's see how how far it takes them. All right, let's see here. Get them get more stuff here. Not sure what type of difficulty I'm looking at exactly. Oh boy, a dragon. I can do that to hurt it. Ow. But the bulls can hurt me. If I do it like that, I'm fine. I would get a lot of treasure. Down here, we got a guy. He likes to move in a weird pattern. Where he'll eventually stop and try and slash you. Hey, these skulls can be broken. Interesting. Ugh. Kill the skull. There we go. Now down here we get more of a pile. Hmm. Oh, I just destroy it. I was thinking, how am I gonna get by there? Just destroy it. Yeah, the main reason I showed that ah, I see those guys coming. The main reason I showed the Wii U mini was just to show that I will get eShop games if there are any good ones. Uh, feel free to recommend any actually. Now I can go that way potentially. But first, there's this way I must take a look at. I have to get him to come close and then he'll slash. That's his pattern. So if we go... Hmm, the skull falls off. Going this way brings us to here. Aha. Where we get more treasures. And we get a musical note on a parchment paper. Whoa, I almost got my jumping stuff confused. No lack of treasures in here. Ah, I almost missed this one. There we go. Almost missed it, but I got it. You came back, though. How stupid are you? Definitely a Mega Man vibe. There's no doubting that. A lot of people take their inspiration when making retro-style games from Mega Man. For some reason, that's the stereotype for some reason. I guess it's kind of the simplest to make, in a way. You know, the screen scrolls at a certain portion, and I think I messed up that. If I want to get that, it's gonna be a lot harder now. Hey, hey, I almost missed that one. Ugh, there's no way I'm getting that. These guys need to respawn. Yeah, there's a lot of respawning in here, I notice. Now, what we can do is try and destroy it all, so that we don't get stuck or anything. Oh look, a giant chicken turkey thing. Recovered all my energy. Let's try and cover everything, maybe. Because why not? From what I read, the game is only roughly eight hours, so roughly eight parts, maybe. Give or take, you know, depending on how long I feel like recording. Because I don't know how long I feel like recording a game such as this. Aha, uh -huh, must be our save point. There we go. Did that easily. Let's just kill this guy. 
Anything else here? Mm-hmm, another dragon thing. We can try and get up there. One thing I will note is, when people are making side-scrolling games, why is it always NES-style games? Why don't they go for s SNES, or even just make something more modern, in a way? A an example I'm gonna use is actually Royal Land Shaken. That was a 2D platforming game, but they used their own unique uh, sprite art, you know? Instead of going for anything stereotypical. I mean, there's no problem with, with uh, making NES-style graphics at all. The problem is if you saturate the market with it. Obviously, the success of Mega Man 9 and 10 were factors in it, but... I guess that's just what people want to do. Can't stop them, really. Anyway, let's continue on up. Enough talking about uh, what we want in games, what we don't want in games. Oh! He surprised me! I'll try and get him out here a bit more. Except this dragon guy's in my way. Okay, I can do it that way. It's actually easier. Anything here? No? Alright. This is how I gotta get up there for sure. There's... Ha, ah, wait a minute. That comes from nowhere. Oh, wait, it does. It actually... Good thing I went back down then, or else I would have missed it. Here we get a treasure chest. Inside we get a lot. A lot of stuff in there. Alright. I even need that stupid dragon to get up here. Yeah, it must be a save point. It's kind of weird that it has a collision for destroying in a way. Can't bend down, I notice. In case an enemy is at an odd height, though, that's not a very good idea. I guess I should have done that to him instead of taking a hit. I guess at least there's a lot of secret areas in here, I notice. Oh, jeez. What I gotta do is this. Just keep an eye on his head here. There we go. And I think I got no recovery. Ah, first death! Brings me back there, I see. Recover! I think it may have got rid of some of my gold. No matter. Yeah, there's one weird thing here. It's the fact that you get launched backwards when you try to hit something. But I see it adds a certain challenge now to it. How many lives do I have anyways? It was an off position to be in, I'll say. Ugh. And now he's dead. I got nothing out of it. Alright, you. Hmm, recover. Okay, fine. Just let him fall off, apparently. Don't even try to hurt him. Apparently that was the better, uh... tactic. I'm gonna try and get this for sure. Huh. Looks like you kind of get momentum when you do this. Try and cover everything possible. Because it looks like there's something hidden in every single thing here. Ow. Bunch of these guys here, too. Any more? Any more? Looks like that's it. Let's not forget this here. For that. Okay, you got some high jumping in here, actually, so it's not too bad. You can actually get to most areas. Looks like another hidden area, I'll say. Yep, and here we get another chest. And inside this chest, we get more treasure. Not really sure what our purpose is of the treasure, but... I'm pretty sure it's mostly just points. Unless there's some sort of collection thing it keeps track of, but that's something I'll find out. There's that tower in the background. Here's the next save point, and I'm pretty sure we'll be coming to a boss soon. Oh, Black Knight. I knew you'd show your face sooner or later. The Cerulean Coward. Turn back, Shovel Knight. There's nothing here for you anymore. Stand aside, Black Knight. I've no quarrel with you. I must return to the Tower of Fate. Your time away has dulled your senses, can't you see? This entire valley has been conquered by the Enchantress. 
and her invincible knights of the Order of No Quarter stand between you and the tower. But none of that matters, because anyone after the Enchantress has to go through me. Steal thy shovel! <laughs> Oh-ho! Nice 8-bit laugh you got going there. Oh yeah, I'm just gonna do this then. How about that? It's coming from above on you. Now what are you gonna do? Aha! Uh -huh. Aha! Let's get away from him doing that. Just keep an eye on his patterns. Looks like going from above is the best tactic because then I can just, uh. Let's watch out when he does that though. Whoa, he came back at me. He ruined the pattern. Every time he laughs, he does that shot. I missed him again. Looks like he follows me when he does that. It actually looks like a Devil Knight. I guess that's supposed to be what he's going for. Okay, now he's gonna shoot that thing again. Hey! You ruined it, you stupid knight! He'll be dead sooner or later, you'll see. Ah, he jumped at me! Looks like he timed it, hey! Hey, hey, hey! Ow! Alright, he's getting a bit harder here, it looks like. Or it could be just me, I don't know. Hmm. Is he actually playing his moves based on mine? That would be an interesting concept if true. There we go. Try and give me a seizure. I had one circle left. It's actually stuff on the bottom screen. I don't know if that was always there or not, though. If I press minus, that nah, does nothing. Peaceful Force, get to take a nap, I guess. Whoa, hey, look who's returning, apparently. Or is this a dream, a flashback? Catch her! Well, that was kind of easy. Oh, it's a dream. Oh, what? Okay. Do I have to do this? Because I can shake him. Oh, I have to wake up. I dug the fire out. Feet accomplished. Only you. Okay. Mm-hmm. Ooh, a map. With the clouds that move. Oh, jeez. What's all this? Village. Plains clear. What's in the village? Might as well continue a little bit longer. Ferals. Halt! No weapon! We have enough to worry about lately without everyone sh swinging swords around. It's a shovel. Oh, haha. -ha, that's no weapon. Just a shovel. You may enter then. And don't forget, press up to talk to everyone. Oh, really? Let's talk to you. Cause no trouble, warrior. What the hell is this thing? Dear lady, I remember before the Order of No Quarter when we weren't afraid to walk around like this. Oh, jeez, a dear lady. I guess I can go into houses? Or not. Pick up blue jars to restore your magic power. I have magic power? Turkeys and apples can restore your life. I just found this out, so I'm telling everyone. Hey, wait, uh, Gold Knight. Make sure to press up to talk to people just like you did now. Yeah, yeah, I know that much. Oh, look, a fiddler. Or a bard playing the loon. Or a loom. Hail, traveler. I am but a simple bard, but I have a big problem. I've lost all my music sheets. My entire repertoire lay scattered across the land. Well, I see what they're, we're collecting that for now. If you ever find a music sheet, return it to me and I shall reward you handsomely. Whoa, you have two music sheets! Magnificent! Take 500 gold for each? Yes! Wonderful! Let's see here. Oh, you found Strike the Earth! Oh, a Stinato Trumpet Triplets. Is there anything you can't render into pure ma magic? Now that I have this music sheet, I can perform it for you anytime. Just ask. Uh, let's wait for now. Molly. Ooh, you've got a pretty face. You should come visit often. Uh, how can you tell? 
Now shovel that hero of music. What can the humble bard do for you today? Play me a song. So anyway, what would you like to hear? Well, I've got, um... Do I already have 7 out of 46, really? Steal thy shovel. Somebody tells me I'm just collecting themes from the game. So let's try this out. Yeah, it's just music from the game, it looks like. And every town should have its own anthem. Tough times call for a spirited song. Enter the arena and feel like a champion. The audience is watching from off-site. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a town theme. Yep. I didn't want to do that. Bye. Bye. Oh, oh, who, blue hair, uh, purple hair kid. Lady Knight. Hey, I remember you. Where is that red knight you used to hang out with? Not here, unfortunately. And what are you? Gatherer. Our old village is overrun with the undead and Spectre Knight. We barely made it out in time. Oh, look, Horseman. Adventurer. If you are getting stressed out, try finishing. Or fishing. You'll never know what you'll catch. Horse Lady. I like to look nice on my day off. Wahaha! <laughs> Get a real weapon! I've, eventually they'll probably repeat. There's no way they're all unique. This is a secret. In Pride Moore, keep going left first is right. Mm hmm. How about you? I just love living in a village. It's the best. They'll probably eventually repeat. Yeah, I've seen you already. Anyway, it doesn't look like there's much else I can do here. Up here is like a shop. Gastrometer. Pottage and poultry, mutton and meat. Your maximum health will increase if you eat. Bring a meal ticket. I'll whip up a feast. Goat Titian might have some now. Where's that sly beast? He's down there. I see a magician as well. There's that sly beast. Ah, decisions, decisions. Should I extend my magic or health? Or just eat a tin can? Why not buy my meal ticket and help narrow my options? Sure. Uh, do I have enough? Yeah, I have enough. Yes. Alright. First purchase. Let us use this meal ticket and extend something, I guess. I'll dazzle your palate in no time or less. So bon appetit and pardon the mess. He sure is serving up a dish. He just extended my life. Hooray! Do you have any more meal tickets, goat man? Uh, how much is a meal ticket anyway? 4,500. Nah. Not this time around. I know this is still over here. A magician. Want more use out of your relics? Oh yes, of course. Uh, I can increase your maximum magic. Good. Oh, but no relics yet. What? I can't. You have to find some relics. Chester, down the ladder. He always has the weirdest things. Wait, what was I doing? Hmm. Ah, uh, Chester down the ladder, eh? That answer my question about the ladder. Chester, you down here? Or four people. Juice mate. Ah, a new face. Dancers, acolytes, witches, goats, everyone's welcome in here. Ooh, that's Spectre Knight. If someone could defeat him, I would bestow upon them my greatest treasure. Deposed King. Oh, woe is me, the king of nothing, not to rule but my lone bar stool. King Knight. Sits on Pride Moore's throne. That gilded goon, he'll get his soon. Grandma Swamp. Double trouble, soil and shovel. My third eye knows your useless infos. Excavation. The number of dig piles you've dug is five. Aram Infiniosa. The amount of gold you've collected is 5644. Thanato Refutatum. The number of times you've fallen in battle is one. Temporum Perpetua. The total of times you've spent adventuring is 20 minutes and 2 seconds. I imagine you see all of your acts. Come back again for more useful facts. Thanks for helping me, kindly witch. I'm not a witch. Oh, really? Is this where Chester is? Yes, I gotta destroy his door. Are you... He looks like a woman. 
Mona. Sorry, I suppose peaceful solitude is too much to ask for. Well, as long as I'm stranded here, shall we pass the time with a little game? I'll just need 100 gold first. Alright, let's try it out. Alright, I'll conjure up some things and you can hit them toward the target for points, okay? Okay. Uh huh, I did that badly. Because I'm confusing my jump. I'm not even doing very good here. There we go. Alright, I'm not getting very many points though. I can't get them all, unfortunately. This seems like the smarter one to get because it could do multiple, I think. It's all green for some reason. I don't know why it's all green. I can head it to the blue sometimes, it seems. I got some points there. I wonder how long this is gonna last. Oh, look at all this. It's probably possible to hit more than one at the same time. Hmm. So, how did I do? You got 165 points. Yawn, well, color me impressed. Feet accomplished, juggler. You're back already. Do you want to play again? Just want your gold. No. Oh, you don't want to? It's okay. I'm used to the disappointment. It looks like I can get our music sheet. How about again quickly for the heck of it? Now they know what I'm doing better. Alright, that's one point. More points for hitting it up there, I see. Which I missed. Based on the angling, mostly. Definitely. So if I, the further I go, the higher up I can hit it into the orange up there. And of course it creates a larger hit when I do that. So already I got a lot more points because of that. See, I hit two there. I hit that up there. Yeah, I see I'm doing a lot better now. Because now I get the idea. Come on, hit this one. It gives me a better chance of scoring big. I don't think I'm doing any better. No, I didn't do any better this time. Okay, fine. Well, I still got some gold. Where's Chester? How about this way? Frog. Croaker. Hey, Shovel Knight. I know things are tough, but don't throw in the towel. I won't. Truple Accolade. Hello, fish friend. All hail the Truple King. Uh, who? Have you ever heard of the Truple King? Half trout and half apple. Pronounced like mouthful. He's one of the Force Gods. Here to help those in need. I'm telling the truth. If you ever visit the Sacred Grotto, hold your chalice aloft and the Truple King will appear. As it happens, I have been entrusted to sell Truple chalices to believers. Would you like one? Uh, okay, sure. Why not? Hold up and press Y. A vessel for storing mythical ecor, but where to find it? Uh-huh. Uh, hail! The king of fruit and fish. Long may his stem grow. So if I hold up and Y, I can have the chalice show. Psst. Hey, blue guy. You wouldn't believe the merchandise I've got for you today. Why not have a look? Uh-huh. Fishing rod. Cast into a pit and wait for a bite. An orb of balanced combat potential. I can try... Uh, you... ...to a pit. Should I buy the other thing too? Might as well, I guess. I'm a little short on gold, unfortunately. I assume I can always come back here, though. I can always play that game again for more gold. Ah, uh, but not for now. I do have a fishing rod. Talk to some of the people here. Hoof kid. Wow, Mr. Knight. Nice stick. Come on, let's play. Oh, really? Are you really the shovel knight? Prove it by digging up this dirt. Okay. There. Wow, incredible! You really are Shovel Knight! Thank you. Yeah, I'm playing with you, little miss. I like to look blah blah blah. Milk Maiden? Beware the lich calling himself the Super Skeleton. The Chevy attacks are ferocious. How about you? Ooh, these buckets are heavy. 
Uh, a lot of people here. Hey, look, a music note up there. How do I get up there? Plain kid, I'm the fastest, no one can count run me. I want to talk to this dude, though. Show Link, may trials await you. Don't despair, may each defeat straighten your resolve. That's cool, but I want to get up there. How would I get up there? Unless... Mmm. The idea's there, but... It doesn't... Wait, wait, wait. Hey, I can walk up on her. Okay, cool. There we go. More stuff to collect here. Well, now I got a lot more gold. But I think I'm done here for now. I can always come back. Spend enough time in the village, probably. Hmm, what's this? Pride more keep. Lair the Night King Knight. The Lich Yard. Lair of Spectre Knight. Locked Gate. Defeat Spectre Knight. Alright, and what's this? Trooper Pond. Well, let's defeat Spectre Knight, maybe. And this will maybe the last thing I do. Ooh, spooky. Mm. Alright. What do we have here? Roots. Uh, I guess I see. Maybe. Yeah, I use that right now to get that stuff up there. What I have to do is like... Yeah, that's how I gotta do it. Fire, I wonder if it'll hurt me. Probably not. It's background stuff. He's got electrified though, gotta be careful about that. Anyway... Hmm. How do I get that one? I could always... Hmm, that looks interesting to get actually. Wait a minute, I see. Well, it's too late to get that one unfortunately. Oh well. I got the idea, at least, though. Hmm. Oh, no, a bomb! I got hurt, too. I'm pretty sure there was something up here. Yeah, a treasure chest. Now it's too late for me to get it. Unless I can somehow bounce on that. Alright, look at this, how much stuff was up there. Damn! Too bad. I don't think I can do it now. If I go back... No, it's gonna be impossible. Oh well. I'll come back for something. There we go. At least I went up here. The ghost. Got rid of it, kind of. But it just reappeared. Uh, can I kill him? There's a thing here. There, I knew there was something secret. Gotta watch the walls. Interesting music with the bass. Alright, watch out here or else he's gonna try and kill me. At least he's got no head, I guess. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, actually. Just gotta whack him like that. Huh. Gotta be careful with him now. Oh! He got me! Gotta watch his jumping. like I can most... Ah! Uh. I got him, but I got hurt quite a bit. Oh no! Wait, wait, wait! Come back! No! I gotta redo it too? Great. That's kind of stupid. Ow. He hurt me again too. Now he's gonna really jump. The best time to get him is when he's falling down and getting up, it looks like. He has that big jump, and then I can get a few hits. Ow! Don't do it that way, though. There we go. Good. At least it came back. Alright, then. Continuing on. Stupid frogs. I think they're frogs, at least. Got electricity that kills. Don't hit the shovel with, like, when he's got electricity going on. Now let's get up here. Get up there. Anyway. Ugh. Anyways, what type of pit are we looking at here for the uh, fishing? Whoa! 
No! Don't do that! Then you got in two memories! Ah, I can't even see half of the time. Ah, I... Stupid ghost too. There we go. Man, this is fun, isn't it? Isn't this fun? It's very fun. Gotta watch out where I'm going. Alright, there's a skull down here. Nothing in it, though. Alright, I made it by. Look at all these guys, though. Just do that to kill them. Oh, a bomb! Skeleton here. Another, uh, turkey chicken thing. Aha, uh -huh. I know what to do here. Oh man, they even got ghosts inside each of them. Ah, of course, they, they make me get hit because I stalled when the ghosts were coming. And they kept him hidden in there. Alright, I made it out though. Alright, up I go again. Mm hmm. I have an idea. But I gotta be very quick about this. So do that, you can get up there. Which brings it to here. Crappy, uh, dark place again. I think I got another musical note, but it's hard to tell. I couldn't see, man! I'll never get that treasure back. No, I'll never be able to do it. It's in a hole. That's sucky now. I, oh yeah, the bomb. I forgot there was a bomb there. I have to get... No, I don't have to come back here. There's no way I'll be able to do that. Because it's in the hole. All because of that ghost when I hit the shovel on him. Yeah, no. Well, I can get two of them if I really want to risk it. Because I go backwards when I use the shovel. I can't see! Ugh! Oh, there we go. I got some of it back, at least. Nothing there. Um... I can walk here, right? Oh, I see what I have to do. At least I'll get crushed, I guess. Lots of treasures here. I can't get rid of his head, it looks like. Just kind of... Ooh, this one goes up. This one goes up too, probably. Oh, actually it goes down. My surprise! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, ah! Uh, come on! There we go. I don't care about the stupid frog. I see the boss is gonna have a lot of energy in this one. Lightning seems to be very random. Alright, I did get him. These darkness portions really suck. Well, you have to do it little by little, it looks like. Damn, I missed it. Anything special? No, nothing special. Oh, I missed it again. Oh, man. Okay, this time it's my fault. Alright, let's try and do this here. Oh! Damn! It's a single death for that. Yeah, I'll try and recover it. Brings me all the way back here now. I'm not liking those flashing portions. Just like Ninja Gaiden 2. I'm not even gonna go back there, I don't think. No point. Alright then. Anyway. Continuing on. Looks like it goes up when I kill the enemies for some reason. I got one of them back. What? I landed in the spike? 
It looks like it sends me back even further. No, it doesn't, actually. I wonder what the saves are like in here. Let's not bother with that. Oh, I've died a few times already. I wonder if that counts as a pit for a fishing. Come on, get back up. Get off you. Ow, he hurt me. Ow, I hurt myself there. Ah, oh, whatever. Alright, let's try to be careful here. Because of that stupid slow walking bug. I can't see him at all, so it's hard to hit him. There we go. Man, I hate where that thing hides too. If I had a more long distance weapon, I'd be able to do this. So what I gotta do is jump on, and then hope for the best. Oh, okay, it's not that hard. I made it hard. Come on, frog. Because we electrifies himself. Hmm. Yeah, sure. Oh, I see what I gotta do here. Gotta get that on that thing. And then I can go down here. He seems to electrify himself when he gets hit, I think. It's down here. Ah! Uh, what the treasure looks like. Ah, uh, get away! There we go. Fortunate. No, that's not unfortunate. I can get back up there. Kind of. I don't think I can get on that side now, though. I need the other enemy back. Let's see if I can go back. Actually, I'm gonna save it here. That way I can get back to it. And then I'm gonna... What I'm gonna try and do is get up there. Come on, get closer. There we go. Now, let's see what's in here. Ah, bomb! Alright, this is supposed to be a secret area, I presume. Big chest. And in here you get Chester. In the village or out in the field, I have all the deals. You're not gonna believe what I just found in this chest. Wanna see? Sure. Uh, what is that? Escape from all harm briefly. Okay. Let's try it. Use up and Y to escape from harm. Now, how do I... There's a bit on my menu down here. I can, uh, select stuff. But I'm not really sure how it works exactly. I should try it out. They keep hurting me, though. Try and get him. His lightning has long reach. Uh, no. There, that's how you do it. I can select, the uh, now. Because on my screen I can see all my items. On the bottom. I, I select minus to do that. Let's just kill these guys. Because they're in my way. Kill their skulls too. Anyway. Hmm. Interesting. I need an enemy to get on here. Like that. Well, that thing up there I need, definitely. Gotta get rid of you too, apparently. Well, let's get this first. And put you down. Unless there was something... Yeah, there's something up here. Hmm, interesting. I knew there was something odd about that. Hey, where'd you appear from? Hey, wait, wait! Okay, good. Oof, that was close. Very close. Hmm. Well... I could use him, but he's a bit too unstable, unfortunately. I hate this ghost. He's so in my way. Let's get rid of you two. Ah, no, I should stop doing that then. It keeps, uh, bringing ghosts. Hey, look, another musical thing. Come on, ghosts. I hate them. Can't get rid of them. Let's try and 
There we go. Now let's just run away from them. Jump occasionally. You respawn. Quite a bit of respawning in this game, it looks like. Anyway, let's go down here now. Stupid ghost. I hate you! Why must you frustrate me? Whoa, hey! I didn't realize that was gonna happen. Now he's here. Great. What a hard place to try and do this, isn't it? I can get back up, it looks like. Well, actually, it's not. I just gotta stay down there, it looks like. I'm making it difficult. That's what's happening. Of course, if he lands on top of me, that's no help. What I could do is like that occasionally. Right now, he does that, and once he jumps again... I can do that. And then just go down here. I mean, it's slow going, but it seems like the smartest thing I could do. Alright, now this time. There we go. Dead. Oh, I need to get back up there now. At least I recovered a bit. Fortunately, I sit for here. I can't get back there. Oh well. Ah, more lightning. More stupid lightning. More stupid electrical frogs, too. If the electricity didn't have such a long reach, I'd be fine. There we go. Alright, there's a skinny platform here. Alright, I'm learning my lesson here. Stop putting that stuff... Oh, man. That's exactly what I gotta do here. I don't like it at all. Bad timing here. What an odd thing they want me to do here. See, I missed it. I gotta wait for it to get a bit closer. Yeah, I know. I need to wait for it to get a bit closer. There we go. Ugh, there we go. Oh man, they got nice guys here. Alright then. At least they only take one hit. But of course they had to throw the ghost at me. Die! Which isn't really dying though. Uh-huh. Okay, good. I thought it was spikes at first. Hmm. There's a another one, but what's this? Aha! Nice! Good thing I saw that. Anyway, try getting to Spectre Knight. This is no place for the living mortal. You shall be summoned when it is your time. And everyone has a time, as we saw with your beloved Shield Knight. Is she dead? Lies! I won't believe such talk from phantoms. Your very existence is a vile deception. Hehehe. <laughs> the Enchantress is just full of surprises. She granted me new life. So that I may take yours! Alright. Let's see how this guy go- Oh, don't do that though. Oh, jeez, I didn't see that one. Go, hmm. I got some attacks on him now. Gotta be very careful with this thing there. Best time to hit him would be around now. Flies around. Oh, jeez, he sliced me. Ow. Ow. I can hit him there. He's got an odd pattern if I do say so. I don't know if it's a pattern. Great. Summon these guys. I got hurt again. I am so dead. Oh! He came and he hurt me. Brings me back there, but at least it's not that far. I mean, I'm not expecting to do that good on my first try. Awesome, my treasure too. Luckily, I can get it back. Got to go through the dialogue again. Good, I don't. Let's try and get this treasure at least. Gonna do this. Oh, hey, you changed it around. How dare you change it around on me? I could use that item I got that will kind of protect me for a little bit, I think. His pattern. I don't know if he even has a pattern, really. I'm just trying to go... 
gonna come up like that. Oh! He, he kind of does have a pattern. I won't say it's the perfect pattern to memorize, but I can eventually kind of see where he's throwing that, except that time I was being an idiot. Because I was way too far off the screen. Alright, when he does that, I gotta watch out, definitely. Mm -hmm. How nice of you to change it up on me. I love when you do that, Spectre Knight. Don't raise the dead, you fool. I don't like raising the dead. Ah, every time that one happens, I seem to screw up. Oh, he just missed me, too. Try to follow him around. Hmm, I see what you did there. Alright. What the? No, you didn't. No, you didn't do that too, did ya? He did it. What a fool. I hate that he did that. Nothing worse than now making it dark. Oh! Because now he's got the advantage. Being a computer and all. Almost dead, though. Me too, though. Ah, damn, I almost got him. He's raising the dead again. I wish I could see very well. I can't see! There we go, just did it. I had trouble there. What exactly is he? Now we get another sequence here in the forest. I guess it's supposed to be some sort of character development, maybe? So we're gonna have to catch, uh... What's-her-face again? Nope. Let's jump up. Get that. Get some extra treasures, it looks like. Anything else here? Anyway. I guess I'll leave. Alright, we did that and unlocked that. Huh? Saving. Alright, well... That was interesting, I'll say. Looks promising so far. Some difficulty in it, but, you know, they're trying to be difficult. On purpose. Anyway, that's it for this part of Shovel Knight. Next time, we'll, well, you know, continue on with it. Too bad I can't show you the little screen on the bottom. It has the logo on it. So yeah, look forward to Persona 3, the most likely final parts of the journey, but uh, give me some time and while I make my way through this quickly. Uh, by the time um, I get through most of this, I should be able to get back to Persona 3. Anyways, see you next time in Shovel Knight.